All right, fellas, want to congratulate you. We had uh, free agents and draft eligible prospects come to San Diego this weekend. Uh, you guys qualified for the 2023 Pro Combine Finals. Today what we're going to do is we're going to highlight your field goal abilities in this competition. Everybody's going to get four field goals to uh, show what they're capable of on film and then the competition will begin. The competition will be a double miss competition until we whittle it down to have one camp winner. Good luck gentlemen, let's get started. Okay, up first we have Chris Nagar. Chris uh, played early in his career at Texas. His senior year, he played at SMU. He was 17 out of 21 on field goals. In the 2021 season, he signed with the Jets. He also had a opportunity to be on the Cleveland Browns practice squad, played in a regular season game. And in 2022, he signed a futures contract with the Dallas Cowboys. Chris is currently a free agent. Chris Nagar. Kick is up, kick is good. Next to him, we have Gabe Burkich. Gabe is a free agent from Oklahoma. He, he participated in the NFL Combine in 2022. At OU, he had an 82.6 career average, including an outstanding season in 2019 where he was 17 out of 17 on field goals and 52 out of 52 on PATs. He had an opportunity in the 2022 football season to get an opportunity with the Minnesota Vikings and Green Bay Packers. He had a hamstring injury in the preseason uh, game with the Green Bay Packers. Recently, he had a Steelers workout. Gabe Burkich, Oklahoma, free agent. Kick is up, kick is good. Next to him, we have Kenny Doak. Kenny is a free agent. He uh, played at Maine, and also he finished his career at Southeast Missouri State. He was first team all-conference and perfect 13 out of 13 on 45 and in field goals in 2021. He had game winners from 40 and 52 yards out in 2018. Kenny Doak, free agent out of Southeast Missouri State. Kick is up. Kick is good. Okay, next three roll in. Okay, these are 30 yard attempts. We have a slight crosswind about three to five miles an hour today. Okay, up next is Peyton Henry. Peyton is a draft eligible player from the University of Washington. He's the school's all time leading scorer. He's fourth uh, highest scorer in Pac-12 history. He made 71 field goals throughout his career, 80.4% kicker. He was 2022 Special Teams MVP and two-time All-Conference kicker. Peyton Henry, University of Washington. Kick is up, kick is good. Next to him, we have Jake Pinniger. Jake played at Penn State. He is also draft eligible like Peyton Henry. He's a four-year starter at Penn State. He's number one in career PATs in school history second all-time leading scorer in Penn State history. He's a Big Ten leader in points in 2018 and leader in field goal percentage in 2019. In 2022, he was six out of seven on 40 plus field goals and two out of two on 50 plus field goals. 2022, he had 70% touchbacks. Jake Pinniger, Penn State. Kick is up, kick is good. Next to him, we have Joe Bovalis. Joe is draft eligible as well. Played at the University of Alabama from 2017 to 2020. He then transferred to Vanderbilt in 2021 and 2022. He was an all-state baseball player in high school. And in 2021, he had two game winners for Vandy. Joe Bovalis, draft eligible. Kick is up. Kick is good. Next three rolling in. We have Tanner Brown. Tanner Brown is also draft eligible. He was a team captain, second team all Big 12 this past season. He was 22 uh, in, in 2022, I'm sorry, in 2022 he had a long of 52 and hit a game winner in the Hula Bowl. He had a 45.5 punt average at his previous stop in UNLV, so he can kick and punt. He's a junior college All-American. Tanner Brown, 
Oklahoma State. Kick is up, kick is good. Next to him, we have Gavin Beckley from UTEP. Gavin is draft eligible. He was 22 out of 24 with a long of 54. He had a school record 22 consecutive field goals in 2022 and 58 career field goals. He was Conference USA, Special Teams MVP, First Team All-Conference, Third Team All-American. Gavin Beckley, UTEP. Kick is up, kick is good. Next to him is Mason Larmy from Western Illinois. He's uh, all-conference honorable mention, long of 53-yard field goal, 22 out of 28 this past season with three blocks, had the highest touchback percentage in the MVC conference, was a special teams captain, Mason Larmy. Kick is up, kick is good. Up next, we have two Japanese players. Shintaro Saki is first, six foot, 180 pounds from Japan. He was 13 out of 15. He was Japanese National Player of the Year. Played at Panas for the Panasonic Impulse. Shintaro Saki from Japan. Kick is up. Kick is good. Okay, up next to him we have Matsuo Kabashi, six foot, 178 pounds from Kobe University, 80% field goals in college. He also played for the Panasonic Impulse. Matsuo Kabashi. Kick is up, kick is good. Here we go, back up five yards. Now we're gonna pick up the pace. Okay, be back in your stance, guys. Let's roll now. So coming back now, we have free agent Chris Nagar. Kenny, get back in your stance. Let's roll. Go ahead, Chris. Kick is good, Gabe Burkich. Kick is good, Kenny Doak. Kick is good, next three, roll in. Peyton Henry, Washington. Kick is good. Jake Pinneger, Penn State. Kick is no good. Joe Buvalis. Kick is good. Let's roll in. These are 35 yard attempts currently. Up first is Tanner Brown, Oklahoma State. Kick is good. Gavin Beckley. Kick is good. Mason Larmy. Kick is good. Up next, Shintaro Saki. Get back in your stance, both of you. Kick is good. Matsado Kabashi. Kick is good. Here we go. Let's back it up to 40. Chris Nagar, 
Followed by Gabe Burkich. Kick is good. Good ball by Chris. Gabe is up. Kick is no good. Wide right. Kenny Doke. Kick is no good. Wide right. Have a little crosswind out on the field today. Left to right. Peyton Henry, draft eligible, University of Washington. Kick is good. Jake Pinniger, Penn State. Good ball by Jake. Kick is good. Joe Bubalis, Vanderbilt. Kick is good. Next three roll in. Up first, Tanner Brown, Oklahoma State. This past season he was 22 out of 23 on field goals. Tanner Brown. Kick is good. Up next, Gavin Beckley. Kick is good. Up next, Mason Larmy, Western Illinois. Kick is no good. Up next are two players from Japan who both qualified. Shintaro Saki. He was 13 out of 15 this past year. Panasonic Impulse. Go ahead. Kick is good. Matsaru Kabashi. Kick is good. Let's back it up. Now we're going to go 45 yards. This will be the last warm up kick before the competition begins. Chris is up. Chris Nagar, free agent out of SMU. Kick is no good. Wide right. Gabe Burkich, Oklahoma. Kick is good. 45 yards out. Kenny Doak. Kick is good. Next group roll in. Up first, Peyton Henry. Draft eligible from Washington. Kick is good. Up next, Jake Pinniger, Penn State. Kick is no good. Up next, Joe Bubalis, Vanderbilt. Kick is good. Next three, roll in. Tanner Brown, Oklahoma State. Kick is good. Gavin Beckley, UTEP. Kick is no good. Mason Larmy, Western Illinois. Kick is no good. Up next, Shintaro Saki, Japan. Kick is good. Matsaru Kabashi.
kick is no good. We're going to stay here now. The competition will begin. It's a double miss competition. They miss once, still alive. Miss twice, they are eliminated. 45 yard field goal, about a five to 10 mile an hour crosswind currently. Chris Nagar. Kick is no good. Gabe Burkich. Kick is good. Kenny Doak. Kick is good. Next group roll in. Peyton Henry. Kick is good. Jake Pinnegar. Kick is good. Joe Bubalis. Kick is no good. Up next, we have Tanner Brown. Good ball. Kick is good. Gavin Beckley. Good ball. Kick is good. Mason Larmy. Kick is good. Next group roll in. Shintaro Saki. Kick is no good. Matsado Kabashi. Good ball. Kick is good. All right, let's back it up to 50 yard attempt, please. Remember now, if you had a miss and you missed this rep, you are eliminated. Up first, Chris Nagar, free agent, SMU. It's a good ball. Kick is good. Gabe Burkich. Kick is good. Kenny Doak. Kick is no good. Peyton Henry, University of Washington draft eligible player. Kick is good. Jake Pinniger, Penn State. Good ball. Kick is good. Joe Bubalis, Vanderbilt. Kick is good. Next group roll in. Tanner Brown, Oklahoma State. Kick is good. Gavin Beckley, UTEP. Kick is good. Mason Larmy, Western Illinois. Kick is good. Up next, Shintaro Saki.
Kick is no good. Matsado Kabashi. Good ball. Kick is good. Let's back it up to 55. Chris is up. Kick is no good. Chris is eliminated. Gabe Burkich. Kick is good. Kenny Doak. Kick is no good. Kenny is eliminated. Peyton Henry. Kick is good. Jake Pinniger. Late Gus got him. It's a miss. Go ahead, Joe Buvales. Kick is no good. That is two for Joe. Next group, Tanner Brown. Good crosswind right now. Kick is no good. Gavin Beckley. It's a good ball. Kick is good. Mason Larmy. Kick is no good. Okay, Shintaro Saki was eliminated, Matsado Kabashi is up. Kick is good. Okay, let's back it up. Let's go 58, 58 yard attempts. Chris is eliminated. Gabe is up. It's a pretty good ball right there because that wind was actually going into his face a little bit. Okay, good ball. Up next, Peyton Henry. Pretty silent right now. Kick is no good. Jake Pinniger. Jake is eliminated. Up next, Tanner Brown. Just a little bit right. Tanner Brown is eliminated. Up next, Gavin Beckley. UTEP. Up next, Mason Larmy, Western Illinois. Kick is no good. Mason is eliminated. 
Up next, Matsaru Kabashi. Good ball. Kick is good. Okay, let's back it up to 60. Where's uh, Peyton? Jump on in. Where's Gavin? Jump on in. Let's go other hash. Hang on just a sec. We'll go right to left here. These are the remaining players. Peyton Henry. Kick is no good. Hang on, Gabe. Gavin, do you have one miss? Stay out of the way, Gabe. Okay, jump on in. Kick is no good. So if Matsaru miss, misses, Gabe Burkich is our, is our winner. Okay, so Gabe Burkich is our champion. Let's give Gabe a hand, guys. Good job. Okay, let's have him kick. Go ahead and hit that ball. Hit that ball. Okay, Burkich made it. Let's keep going. Let's give you one from 65. Last attempt. Just a little wide right. Let's give Gabe a hand. Great job. Good job. Thanks. Good job. All right. Hey, fellows, congratulations on making the finals. We had a good group of punters here this year, free agent and draft eligible punters. You guys uh, separated yourselves on charts and in competitions. And in today's event, we're going to give you guys four punts to show what you're capable of doing and then the competition will begin. The competition will be, uh, you have to meet a hang time standard and a distance standard in order to qualify to the next round. You'll have two attempts each round until we have one camp wide champion. Good luck today, gentlemen. Let's get started. Okay, up first we have Dom Maggio. Dom is a free agent. He played at Wake Forest. He's a four year starter, three time All ACC. He's a freshman All American. He's uh, 24 years old. In 2019, he had a 46.8 average with 30 inside the 20 and 30 50 yard plus punts. In 2020, he uh, got signed by the Ravens. 2021, he got signed by Atlanta. And uh, he won this competition uh, coming out of, out of college in 21. Okay, in 2022, he signed a futures contract with Atlanta and was with the practice squad. He's 24 years old, and he's a current free agent, Dom Maggio. First punt, 44 yards, 
3.43 seconds of hang time. Thirty-two yard ball, four point eight two seconds of hang time. This next one will be a directional right call. Better ball. Fifty-one yard ball with five zero zero hang time. This next one will be a flip flop. Thirty-four yard ball with four point four nine seconds of hang time. Up next we have Ethan Evans. Ethan is draft eligible out of Wingate University. He participated in this year's East-West Shrine game and Hula Bowl. He has been the top three in uh, D2 the last two seasons in, bro in both gross and net average. He has a 44.0 career average. He has 156 touchbacks on kickoffs out of 213 attempts. He has held in, in the past and other noteworthy stuff. He's very good in the weight room and a good athlete. He uh, benches 405 pounds, squats 700 pounds, has an 855 pound deadlift, and a 39.8 inch vertical jump. Ethan Evans, draft eligible, Wingate University. 40 yard ball, 4.98 seconds of hang time. 48 yard punt, 4.94 seconds of hang time. Now this is gonna be a directional right call. Forty-yard ball, three point nine zero seconds of hang time. This will be a flip flop. Thirty-five-yard 35 ball, five point one nine seconds of hang time on a flip flop. Up next, we have Joe Doyle. Joe, Joe Doyle is a draft eligible player. He started off his career in 2017 to 2020 at the University of Tennessee. 2021 and 22, he ended his career in college at Memphis. He's a freshman All-American in 2018, an all-conference player in 2022. He's held for four years. He had a 43.6 career average and a 46.0 average the last two years. Joe was also an Under Armour All-American in high school in 2017. Joe Doyle, draft eligible, Memphis. 48 yard ball, 4.72 seconds of hang time. Forty-yard ball, four point nine eight seconds of hang time. Directional right. Thirty-five yard ball, four seconds of hang time. Flip flop. 43-yard ball, 4.67 seconds of hang time. Up next, we have Jake Julian. Jake Julian's a free agent punter. He was a five-year starter at Eastern Michigan. He was a three-time all-conference player. He had, uh, uh, last season, a 46-yard average in college with a 44 net. He held for three years. He has kicked off in games. 2022, he was signed by the Patriots. 
He had workouts this past season with the Jets, Chargers, and New England Patriots during the season. Free agent punter, Jake Julian. Fifty-six yard ball, four point six five seconds of hang time. Fifty-eight yard ball, four point five seven seconds of hang time. Directional right. Forty-six yard ball, four point eight seven seconds of hang time. Up next, flip flop. 39-yard ball, 4.81 seconds of hang time. Up next, we have Daniel Trejo, a, def uh, a draft-eligible player from the University of Texas. In 2021, he was at Texas Wesleyan, had a 39.5-yard average, and did all three disciplines. 2022 at Texas, he started 13 games with a 42-yard average and a long of 61 in a game. Daniel Trejo, University of Texas, draft eligible. 39-yard ball, 4.25 seconds of hang time. 49 yard punt, 4.62 seconds of hang time. Directional right. 50 yard ball, 4.60 seconds of hang time. Flip flop. 35 yard ball, 4.47 seconds of hang time. Up next we have Bar Barney Armour. Barney was a, a draft eligible player from Penn State University. 2021 and 22 he started at Penn, or he was at Penn State. 2022 he started, he has a 44.3 career average with a 41 net. He has held and he is a Big Ten Honorable mention player this past season. Prior to Penn State, he played at Colgate in 2018-2020. He had a 42.1 net and the highest, highest in school history he held at Colgate as well. Penn State draft eligible punter, Bar Barney Amore. 32 yard ball, 4.03 seconds of hang time. 33 yard ball, 4.35 seconds of hang time. Directional right. 49 yard ball, 5.03 seconds of hang time. Flip flop. 41 yard ball, 4.46 seconds of hang time. Up next we have Caleb Lightborn. Caleb is a free agent. 2016 to 2018, he was at the University of Nebraska, had a 42.1 average. 2019, 2020, he was at Oregon State, a 41.8 average. 2021, he was at Idaho, had a 44.4 average, which was seventh in the FCS. 
72% touchbacks on kickoffs. He signed with the Edmonton Elks. He has held, kicked off, and punted during his time in Edmonton. Thirty-four yard ball, four point four one seconds of hang time. Fifty-three yard ball, four point zero nine seconds of hang time. Directional right. Forty yard ball, four point nine three seconds of hang time. Flip flop. Thirty six yard ball, four point five zero seconds of hang time. Up next we have Kyle Greenwell. Kyle was at UAB, University of Alabama, Birmingham from 2018 to 2022. He's all conference in 21 and 22. He had a 45.3 average in this past season in 22. Holds multiple school records and he has held for four years as a uh, holder for the field goal kicker. Kyle Greenwell, UAB draft eligible. 36 yard ball, 3.31 seconds of hang time. 55, 55 yard ball, 4.51 seconds of hang time. Directional right. 48 yard ball, 4.43 seconds of hang time. Flip flop. 44. Pretty good ball. 44 yard ball, 4.46 seconds of hang time. Our last punter is Tyler Zentner from Kansas State University. 2017 and 18, he was at Butler Junior College. Transferred then to Kansas State. Did all three at his time at Kansas State. He started on punt and kickoffs primarily. He had a 44.6 average in 2022. And he had 29 punts this past season that had 4.5 seconds of hang time or higher during the games. He holds school records in kickoffs and punts at Kansas State University. Tyler Zentner, draft eligible. 36, 4.12. 48 yard ball, 4.70 seconds of hang time. Directional right. 40 yard ball, 3.68 seconds of hang time. Flip flop. 49. Good ball. 40, 49 yard ball, 4.28 seconds of hang time. We're going to get to the competitive phase now. They have two punts to hit a 40 yard ball with over four seconds of hang time. Coach, keep giving us distance. Go ahead. 50. 50 yard ball, 4.17. That is a qualifier. Up next, Ethan Evans.
44, 4.01. That is a qualifier. Forty-one, four point seven seven seconds of hang time. Jake Julian. Good ball. Sixty-one yard ball, four point five seven seconds of hang time. Daniel. That is short, has one more attempt to qualify. qualify. Forty-three yard ball, four point five six seconds of hang time. Up next, Bar Barney or Moore, Penn State. Fifty-five yard ball, four point four zero seconds of hang time. Up next, Caleb Lightborn. Punters, move up for me, please. Fifty yard ball, four point seven zero seconds of hang time. Kyle Greenwell. Forty-eight, four point five one seconds of hang time. Tyler Zentner. Fifty-yard 50 ball, four point five five seconds of hang time. We're going to up the requirements now. Forty-two yards, four point two seconds of hang time. Forty-two, four two. Two attempts to qualify. Ball by Dom. 54 yard ball, 4.78 seconds of hang time. Ethan. Good ball by Ethan Evans, Wingate University. 56 yard ball, 4.90 seconds of hang time. Up next, Joe Doyle, Memphis. Good ball by Joe. 45 yard ball, 4.93 seconds of hang time. Jake Julian, Eastern Michigan. 45. Good ball by Jake. 58, 58 yard ball, 4.94 seconds of hang time. Up next, Daniel Trejo from Texas, University of Texas. 45, 40. It is short, 40 yard ball, 4.62 seconds of hang time, second attempt to qualify. Got it. 43 yard ball, 4.61 seconds of hang time. Up next, Barney or Moore, Penn State. 47. Good ball by Barney. 47 yard ball, 5.06 seconds of hang time. Up next, Caleb Lightborn, free agent. Fifty-three yard ball, four point six zero seconds of hang time. Up next, Kyle Greenwell. Kyle's from UAB. Pretty decent punt. 
49 yard ball, 4.76 seconds of hang time. Up next, Tyler Zentner. Good ball. Fifty-four yard ball, four point eight six seconds of hang time. Now we're gonna up the criteria to a forty-five yard punt with four point five seconds of hang time. Forty-five, four five. First up, Don Maggio, free agent. Forty-two yard ball with 4.40 seconds of hang time. Second attempt, Dom Maggio. 38. Dom Maggio is eliminated. Up next, Ethan Evans, Wingate University, draft eligible. Good ball by Ethan, big ball. 61 yard ball with 4.80 seconds of hang time. Up next, Joe Doyle. Good ball by Joe. 52 yard punt, 4.74 seconds of hang time. Up next, Jake Julian. Good ball by Jake. 52 yard ball, 4.87 seconds of hang time. Up next, Daniel Trejo. Fifty nine yard ball, 4.40 seconds of hang time has another punt to qualify. Thirty-five, three point nine five, Daniel is eliminated. Up next, Barney Amore, Penn State. Forty yard ball, four point nine two seconds of hang time. Thirty two yard ball, three point five six seconds of hang time. Up next, Caleb Lightborn, free agent. Fifty-three yard ball, four point seven three seconds of hang time. Up next, Kyle Greenwell, UAB. Fifty yard ball, four point one two seconds of hang time. Second attempt to qualify. Fifty yard ball, four point six eight seconds at the hang time. He qualified. Tyler Zentner. Twenty nine yard ball, four point two one seconds at hang time. Fifty-two yard ball, four point five one seconds of hang time. He did qualify. Now we're going to back it up. Forty-seven, four seven. Two attempts to qualify. Ball has to go forty-seven yards with four point seven seconds of hang time. Forty-four. 
44, 4.28 seconds of hang time. Second attempt to qualify Ethan Evans. Good ball, gonna have a chance. 53, 4.76 seconds of hang time. Wind is swirling today. It's kind of swirling around. Makes sometimes hitting a clean ball a little more difficult, but it's good, good to judge people in these conditions. Joe Doyle, Memphis. Forty-six yard ball, four point three seven seconds of hang time. Second attempt to qualify, Joe Doyle. Forty-five yard ball, four point six six seconds of hang time. Joe Doyle is eliminated. Up next, Jake Julian, free agent. Fifty-six yard ball, four point six six seconds of hang time. Has to go again. Good ball, but not quite high enough. Thirty-nine, four point five nine seconds of hang time. Up next, Caleb Lightborn. Fifty-four yard ball, four point nine six seconds of hang time. Caleb did qualify. Up next, Kyle Greenwell. Good ball by Kyle. Fifty-two, four point seven six seconds of hang time. He did qualify. Ty Zentner. 48 yard ball, 4.70 seconds of hang time. Did qualify. All right, let's back it up, coach. We're going to go 55 0. Give everybody a chance to qualify. If no one qualifies in this round, it will be best ball on the next round. Thirty-five, four point two eight. Fifty-four. Got it. Fifty-four, five point zero three seconds of hang time. Ethan Evans, Wingate. Caleb Lightborn. Forty, three point nine five seconds of hang time. Fifty three, four point six nine seconds of hang time. Caleb is eliminated. Kyle Greenwell, UAB. Thirty-eight yard ball, three point five nine seconds of hang time. Good ball. Let's see if it gets there. Fifty-two yard ball, five point one five seconds of hang time. Up next, Tyler Zentner.
45 yard ball, 4.84 seconds of hang time. <clears throat> Thirty-six yard ball, four point six five seconds of hang time. We have two com competitors left. We're gonna go big ball wins. Each each competitor will get two punts. We'll f we'll rotate. Okay, Ethan will go. Kyle, Ethan, Kyle. B overall, big ball is the winner. Great punt. 58 yard ball, 5.26 seconds of hang time. Fifty yard ball, 4.45 seconds of hang time. Second punt for Ethan Evans. Forty yard ball, four point eight three seconds of hang time. So right now the big ball by Ethan is fifty eight five two six. All right. Ethan is our champion. Let's give him a hand. Good job, Ethan. Good work, sir. Good job. All right. Hey, fellas, congratulations on uh, making the finals of the snapping portion. You guys went through charting yesterday. Today we're going to showcase your snapping ability, movement ability, and then we'll finish with some shorts. We're going to go three uh, snap, uh, snap and protects from the right side, three from the left side for a total of six snaps. We're going to do one snap and release to show you running downfield, and then we're going to finish with three short snaps. Everybody will get a total of 10 snaps. Let's get started. Okay, to start off, we have Broughton Hatcher. He is draft eligible from Old Dominion University. Six foot four, 242 pounds. He's a four year starter, 2022. He's a team captain, had four total tackles. Broughton Hatcher, Old Dominion University, draft eligible snapper. .68. Up next, we have Brady Sorensen. Brady is up. He's a free agent from South Dakota State. He's a 2021 grad. He's six foot one, 250 pounds. He's a four-year starter. He had four total tackles. Perfect charting score by Brady Sorensen from South Dakota State, free agent snapper. Go ahead, Brady. Point six seven for Brady. Broughton is up again. Point six seven. Brady is up. Point six seven. Good location. Broughton is up. Old Dominion. Point six eight for Broughton. Brady Sorensen, free agent, South Dakota State. Point six eight for Brady. Our next two snappers. Casey Kelahar is a draft eligible player from the University of Oklahoma. Five foot ten, two hundred and thirty-five pounds. He's a five-year starter and played in sixty-five consecutive games. He as well had four total tackles and also had a perfect charting score yesterday. Casey Kelahar, University of Oklahoma, draft eligible snapper. 0.66. Bryce Bowens, draft eligible from Western Michigan University. 5'11", 236 pounds, five-year starter 
five all-conference nominations, 11 career tackles. Bryce Bowens, Western Michigan, draft eligible. Point seven one. Up next, Casey Kellhart, Oklahoma. Point six seven. Up next, Bryce Bowens, Western Michigan. Point six nine. Up next, Casey, Oklahoma. Point six seven. Good snap, Bryce Bowens. Western Michigan. Point seven zero. Up in the next two snappers. Jack Landhair from uh, UCLA, six foot one and a half, two hundred and forty pounds, four year starter, four career tackles, two forced fumbles. Dean's list, Pac twelve honor roll, captain senior year, and a manly award finalist. Jack Land here. Point six eight. Evan Deckers, draft eligible, started four years at UMass, then one year at Duke. Fifty-three total games started, five career total tackles. He's six foot two and three quarters and two hundred and forty-five pounds. Evan Deckers. UMass. Okay, Jack Lander, UCLA. Point six seven. Evan Deckers. Point six nine. Jack Lander. Point six six. Evan Deckers, UMass. Point seven one. Up next, we have Dalton Godfrey. He's draft eligible, five-year starter at South Dakota. He had 11 total tackles, three-time All-Conference, two-time All-American, team captain his senior year. Six foot, one and, one and a fourth, 235 pounds. Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota. Point six nine. Drew Jackson, he's a free agent. He played at Wayland Baptist University. Four year starter from 2016 to 2019. He had one solo tackle and five assisted tackles senior year. Six foot two, 255 pounds. Drew Jackson, free agent, Wayland Baptist University. Point seven one. Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota. Point six nine, Drew Jackson. Point seven one, Dalton Godfrey. Point six nine, Drew Jackson. Point seven one. Okay, here we go. Next groups are up. We're gonna get Broughton Hatcher again now up first. Old Dominion University, six foot four, two hundred and forty-two pounds. Point six eight. Brady Sorensen, South Dakota State. Free agent. Snap. Point six eight. Broughton Hatcher, draft eligible, Old Dominion. Point seven, 
0.67. Brady Sorensen, free agent, South Dakota State. Point six eight, Broughton Hatcher, Old Dominion. Point six seven, Brady Sorensen, South Dakota State. Point six seven. Up next, Casey Kelher, University of Oklahoma. Point six six, Bryce Bowens, Western Michigan. Here we go, Casey's up, Oklahoma. Point six seven, Bryce is up, Western Michigan. Point six nine, Casey's up. Good job. Bryce Bowens, Western Michigan. Point seven. Up next, Jack Lander, UCLA. Point six seven. Evan Deckers, UMass. Okay, both of these guys are draft eligible. Jack, UCLA. Point six seven. Evan Deckers, UMass. Point six seven. Good job. Let's keep it going. Jack, UCLA. Point six seven. Here we go, Evan Deckers. Stopwatch is hit on auto repeat right now. Here we go. Point six eight. All right. Here we go. Next two guys. Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota State, draft eligible, and Drew Jackson, free agent. Dalton's up. Point seven one, Dalton Godfrey. Drew Jackson, Wayland Baptist. Point seven one, Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota. Point seven two. Point six nine. Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota. Point six nine. Drew Jackson, Wayland Baptist University, free agent. Okay, now we're going to go to the snap and release portion, okay, this will be on air, okay, let's try to, uh, we're going to run right through that area, okay, yep, all right, we're going to start off right here with Broughton, Brady will be up second. All right, point six nine on the snap. Brady Sorensen is up next. South Dakota State. Point six seven. Up next, Casey Kelleher from Oklahoma. Point six seven. 
Up next, Bryce Bowens, Western Michigan. Point six eight. Up next, Jack from UCLA. Point six eight. Up next, Evan Deckers, UMass. Point six eight. Up next, Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota. Point six nine. Up next, Drew Jackson, Wayland Baptist University. Point seven. All right, we're gonna finish now with our short snaps. Get set and we'll get rolling here on short snaps. Okay, we'll go right down the line and we'll fill in. Okay, Broughton Hatcher's up. Everybody's gonna get a total of three snaps. Old Dominion University. Brady Sorensen is next. Casey Kelleher. Bryce Bowens. Okay, next group roll in. Jack Lander, UCLA. Evan Deckers, UMass. Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota. Up next, Drew Jackson, Wayland Baptist. All right, next group, roll in. Okay, we'll let everybody get set. All right, let's keep it rolling. Broughton Hatcher, Old Dominion. Brady Sorensen, South Dakota State. Casey Kelleher, Oklahoma. Bryce Bowens. Okay, next group, roll in. All right, Jack is up, UCLA. Evan Deckers, UMass. Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota. Drew Jackson. Okay, here we go, roll in. Broughton Hatcher, Old Dominion. Good snap. Brady Sorensen, South Dakota State. Casey, Oklahoma. Bryce Bowens, Western Mish. All right. Here we go, Jack, UCLA. Good snap. Evan Deckers, UMass.
Dalton Godfrey, South Dakota. Drew Jackson, Wayland Baptist. All right, and that'll conclude our snapping portion. All right, fellas, congratulations on making the finals. You guys charted yesterday on kickoffs, and you guys also had a competition today to qualify for this event. We're gonna hit three kickoffs here. We've got Swirling Wind Stadium in San Diego. It's 57 degrees. Should be a good day for you guys to compete. And show yourselves amongst this talented group how you compare to one another. All right, we're gonna get started. Ethan Evans is up first. Let's get going, fellas. Ethan Evans is from Wingate University. He had an outstanding college career as both a punter and as a kickoff specialist. He had over 150 touchbacks in his college career. He uh, was an East-West Shrine participant this past uh, January, and he also played in the Hula Bowl. Ethan Evans from Wingate University. Seventy-four yard ball, three point nine seven for a score of one fourteen. Ethan Evans. Up next is Isaiah Gomez from UC Davis. He's draft eligible. Seventy-five percent field goals over the course of his career. Forty-one out of seventy-one on touchbacks. Isaiah Gomez from UC Davis. Seventy-five with three-six hang. Our leader right now is Ethan Evans with the score of one fourteen. Up next, we have Andrew Mavis from Iowa State University. Iowa, uh, Andrew played in the Senior Bowl and signed with the Jacksonville Jaguars in the two thousand twenty-two season. He's a current free agent. Andrew Mavis. Sixty-two yard ball with four point two eight seconds of hang time. Up next is Gabe Burkitch from Oklahoma. Gabe signed with the Green Bay Packers, the Minnesota Vikings last year. He's a current free agent from the University of Oklahoma. Gabe Burkitch. Sixty-seven yard ball with three point nine five seconds of hang time. Up next is Joe Buvalis from Vanderbilt. Joe signed out of high school at the University of Alabama and played his last two years at Vanderbilt. Joe Buvalis. Seventy-three yard ball with three point four two seconds of hang time. Up next is Kenny Doak. Kenny Doak is a free agent from Southeast Missouri State. Played at Maine and finished his career at Southeast Missouri State. Current free agent, Kenny Doak. 62 yard ball with 4.18 seconds of hang time. Second wave of the first round now is Jake Pinniger from Penn State. Jake has uh, some school records, very prolific scorer throughout his time at Penn State and finished his uh, senior year kicking off for the Nittany Lions. Draft eligible, Jake Pinniger. Sixty-four yard ball, four point one eight seconds of hang time for Jake Pinniger. Up next is Gavin Beckley from UTEP. He had an outstanding senior year, kicked off and kicked field goals at UTEP. Gavin Beckley. Seventy-seven 
67 yard ball with 4.06 seconds of hang time. Up next is Gunner Jones. Gunner played at Chadron State, was 10 out of 16 this past season, first team all conference. Had two 57 yard field goals in a game, draft eligible, Gunner Jones. Sixty-one yard ball with four point zero three seconds of hang time. Up next, Alfredo Gachos Lazada from Mexico City plays at Monterey Tech. Thirteen out of sixteen on field goals. He's twenty-six years old from Mexico City. Alfredo. Sixty-four yard ball with four seconds of hang time. Up next is Chris Nagar from SMU. He's a free agent. He has played in a regular season NFL game, had multiple stints in the NFL, and he's a current free agent out of SMU. Sixty-nine yard ball, three point five six seconds of hang time. Up next is Caleb Lightborn. Caleb's a current free agent, kickoff punter. His last school that he played at was Idaho. Sixty-eight yard ball, four point zero eight seconds of hang time. Second round now. We have Swirling Wind Stadium going on, kind of holding that ball up for a lot of these guys, but you still get an opportunity, apples and apples, to see how they're competing against one another. Second round, Ethan Evans. Good ball. 73 yard ball, 4 1, 2 hang time for another score of 114. Our current leader, Ethan Evans. Up next is Isaiah Gomez, UC Davis. Sixty-eight yard ball, 3.17 seconds of hang time. Up next, free agent from Iowa State, Andrew Mavis. Sixty-four yard ball, four point one four seconds of hang time. Up next, Gabe Burkich, Oklahoma. Miss it. 57 yard ball, 2.69 seconds of hang time. Up next, Joe Bubalis, Vanderbilt. Sixty-three, 3.98 seconds of hang time. Kenny Doke. Free agent, Southeast Missouri State. Good ball. 69, 3.73 seconds of hang time. Second wave of the second round, Jake Pinnegar, Penn State. Good ball. 69 yard ball, 4.1 seconds of hang time. 
Score a 110 by Jake. Up next, Gavin Beckley. Sixty-nine yard ball, three point four zero seconds of hang time. Up next, Gunner Jones. Sixty-eight yard ball, four point zero one seconds of hang time. Up next is Alfredo. Sixty-three yard ball, three point nine six seconds of hang time. Up next, Chris Nagar. Pretty good hang time. Sixty-five yard ball, four point two zero seconds of hang time. Up next, Caleb Lightborn. 75-yard ball with 4.04 .04 seconds of hang time. That's our new leader with the score of 115. Score of 115, Caleb Lightborn. Ethan Evans, 72-yard ball, 3.70 seconds of hang time. Ethan was our leader. He had two scores of 114. Caleb just overtook him with a 115. Up next, Isaiah Gomez, UC Davis. Seventy-one yard ball, three point four one seconds of hang time. Up next, Andrew Mavis, Iowa State. Sixty-six yard ball with four point three one seconds of hang time. Good hang time on that kick. Up next. Gabe Burkich, Oklahoma. 66 yard ball, 3.34 seconds of hang time. Up next, Joe Buvalis, Vanderbilt. 62 yard ball, four seconds of hang time. Up next, Kenny Doak. 72 yard ball, 3.92 seconds of hang time. Score 111. Up next, Jake Pinnegar, Penn State. 66 yard ball, 3.9 seconds of hang time. Up next, Gavin, Gavin is up from UTEP. 68 yard ball, 3.75 seconds of hang time. Nine. 
69 yard ball, 3.96 seconds of hang time. Up next, Alfredo. Good ball. 68 yard ball, 4.06 seconds of hang time. Up next, Chris. Good ball by Chris. 76 with the 406, rounds up to a 117. 117, our new leader. Caleb Lightborn, last kickoff. So our winner, Chris Nagar, give him a hand. Good job. Seventy-five yard ball with three point seven seconds of hang time. A score of one twelve. Seventy-two yard ball with three point seven seconds of hang time. Seventy-two yard ball with 3.91 seconds of hang time. That's a score of 111 for Kenny Doak. Good ball. 71 with 3.93 seconds of hang time for a score of 110. Seventy yard ball, four point one zero seconds of hang time. Score one eleven. Sixty nine yard ball, four oh one hang time. Seventy-two yard ball with the three nine six rounds up. That's a score of one twelve. Sixty-eight yard ball, four point one seven seconds of hang time. Seventy-one, three point eight five, which rounds up to three nine, one ten. 